Oh, dude, it's time for another beer review. For this one, we're off to Dry Gate out of Glasgow, and it is Double Dirigable, a smoothie IPA coming in at 7.3% to 440ml can. Picked this up in Lidl, in the Lidl Beer Festival. I didn't get a lot of the Lidl, well, I've only got three or four. I was on holiday in Greece at the time when the beer festival dropped, so um, I've got one of the stragglers. Um, I reviewed Krabby's Strawberry and Lime Ginger Beer the other day, and I picked this up at the same time. So, yeah, it says it's peach and raspberry flavour. Now, um, Dry Gate do a beer called Disco um, Dirigable. I haven't had it. Um, that's 5.1% according to Untapped. Um, no doubt um, Disco at Rasco and Disco's has had it because he, I think he's, he has every beer that has the word Disco in it, so he'll have had it. Um, but we'll see what we get with this. I find him a solid brewery. Um... Nothing that really blows my socks off, but um, I don't have any that are like really, really bad. Um, straight away as I'm pouring this, it is that peachy colour. Got a, looking like it's got a slightly off white head as I'm pouring it. Um, so yeah, um, very vigorous carbonation, racing up to a bit of a knobby pour. Slightly off white head, um, tight bubbles in it. That is racing in it. Absolutely racing in the glass. A little bit of a... I'm going to go with a, a pale yellow colour at the bottom of the glass. So we'll get the nose. Peach is in absolute abundance. Um, yeah, it smells like um, sherbet-y. Not, not picking up really the raspberry. The peach is absolutely taking over. But... Um, a smoothie IPA. Um, I don't know what I was expecting in terms of seeing the body. Um, it certainly doesn't look like the smoothie sours, but yeah. Well, oh well, we'll dive in. Cheers, everybody. My word, I wasn't expecting that. Um, really, really tart, peach and raspberry. Um, it's got quite a cloying mouthfeel. And then this bitterness on the finish. It's really unbalanced. Um, actually getting a little bit like burning sensation on my tongue. Um, yeah, um. I'm not impressed, to be honest. Um, yeah, I, I, I really, like I say, I didn't know what to expect with them calling it a smoothie IPA, but there's like a tartness about it. It's almost like a sour IPA. Um, I'm, I'm not, I'm not keen. Um, if they called it a sour IPA, I, I couldn't. I, I would have said it's it's kind of doing what it says. The flavours of peach and raspberry that it says on the on the tin are there, so I'll give them credit for that. But it's almost like floral. Um, no, it's it's not for me. Um, nearly Parma Violet esque, but yeah, I'm a bit underwhelmed on this one, sadly. Um, I'm going to struggle to finish that. Um, far too sweet. Um, pretty unbalanced. So, yeah. A disappointing one. It wasn't expensive, but, um, yeah, un underwhelmed with that one. So, not one I'm going to recommend, sadly. Not the best beer yet. I'll get it finished, but um, I certainly wouldn't be in a rush to have it again. So, that's Double Dirigable from Drygate. I'll add it to my little playlist. Thank you for watching it. On to the next one. Cheers.